So we will stand up all together. Raise our eyes up to the sky with faith and love in our hearts. We will embark. Oh, we will be. Athens in Benfica now. Athens lost. Uh, well, Athens won against Ajax. Athens won against Ajax 1 0 last time out. Benfica lost to Bayern Munich 2 0. Retro tried to correct the course of the ball, but it wasn't going in. Another bicycle hit. Roundhouse. Roundhouse with the shot again. Thank you very much. Retro has a bit of that. And FOMO credited with the assist. That is 1-0 to Benfica. Sticks with the shot. And he gets it in anyway. There's the equalizer. Here comes Retro! Retro gets the assist! Junker with the goal!
And Tex with the equaliser. What a save there from Tex on Jonker's shot. And after being behind twice, we finally take the lead. Wait just a minute, hang on, oh my goodness me, what a se- Three shots! Just like that and none of them going in! Oh my goodness me, it's another goal fest. Thirty seconds to go. We could be witnessing our first overtime match of the day! Not a Junker has anything to do with it! Absolutely incredible! Benfica steal the win right at the end. Goody! Sam, in, ish, ego! respect for this stadium because I love the challenge of it. Cougar! Going! Incredible! And going demolishing retro, thank you very much. Uh-oh! I could have ended badly for Retro. Go and assist in Maverick, that's 1-0! To Athens!
Rainmaker and Retro both getting a shot, but not quite getting the target. What a save from Retro! How often do you see one of those? And that's two! Munich in trouble here! Munich are in trouble! I love the fact he just said it's said he said safe, but there wasn't enough. My goodness, me! I think it's three nil now. Beggar's belief. Not making much of a difference here, but Munich may be in danger of losing top spot in the group. But with a difference of nine, it's looking very unlikely at this point. It's looking very unlikely that um, Munich are gonna Munich are gonna lose top spot in the group. Thirty seconds to go. If they concede another two goals here, they may be in danger of losing that top spot. But here comes Retro. Great save from Goose. Son, in, ish, eagle. Hoffenheim and Shakhtar Donetsk next. Next, Hoffenheim, Shakhtar Donetsk, Donetsk next. As it stands, Shakhtar top of the group after their 2-0 win against Manchester City last time out. And Lyon winning 4-2 against Hoffenheim. But interestingly, it is surprisingly Manchester City that are the ones in danger at the moment.
Armstrong with the shot. Twice over. And there it is. Shakhtar 1 0 up. And Yuri gets the goal. Great equaliser there from Hoffenheim. Here comes Retro! Great save there from Retro! Armstrong! The save wasn't enough! And Retro! An outlaw! Has just cancelled out that equaliser just like that. And that has put Shakhtar Donetsk back in the lead. About a minute to go. Storm with the shot! Not quite finding the target.
And that's 4-2 there now. Here comes Retro! What a save! With how fast that shot came in, beggars belief! And even then, it isn't enough. Shakhtar Donetsk maintain the top of the group. Lyon and Manchester City. Leon in blue, Manchester City in orange. Manchester City need to at least get a win here to have any chance of pushing forward in this campaign. Otherwise, the second half of the campaign is going to be a real struggle for them. And that, there we go, there's one for City, here we go. Great save there from Slider. And that is not going in. Retro with the shot! Retro with the equalizer! This may prevent... May prevent man that equalizer may prevent Manchester City from getting their first win of the campaign. Which in a way is very concerning. But they've only gone. They've only gone and done it. They've only gone and got back in the lead.
Here we go! Dude with the assist. And Shepard with the goal itself. And again, City could be prevented from actually winning the match. Retro, thank you very much! Behind twice, and would you believe it? But Manchester City equalised! And that's beggars believe Manchester City are back in the lead. Demol Demolition on slider. Two groups left now. Victoria Plzen and AS Roma. So even with Manchester City's 4-3 win earlier it wasn't enough to propel them it wasn't enough to take them off the bottom of the group on goal scored yes they're starting to push themselves up but even then, they're still bottom of the group on, even though they're tied on points. They're bottom based on goal difference and goals scored as well. And Kenzie Retro still scored anyway somehow. How on earth did he manage that?
That's one to Plazen, who's in blue, and AS Roma in orange. 1 0 to Plazen. Great clearance there. Storm's shot not going in. Keeping it in AS Roma's half. So just two groups to go. This and group H. Shakhtar Donetsk still, still have a 100% record in the campaign so far. Three games, three wins. Sticks with the shot, Heater with the save. Oh, incoming! Bomo tried to get the shot, but it wasn't to be. Shepard demolishing Foma. Retro again with the clearance. In the last group game. And Shepard scores. Heater with the assist. CSK Moscow demolishing Victoria Plazen 6 0. And AS Roma beating Real Madrid. Losing to Real Madrid 4 0. Each team has a win to their name. But based on goal difference, Victoria Plazen are very unlikely to go top. Storm there, great defensive work there. Wasn't enough because Foma has just put Plazen back in the lead. Just like that. Oh no, big mistake from Retro! Woo! Saved by the bell. Almost 3 1 there, but not to be. Thirty seconds left. A tight game. Proved to be nearly. Fulmer! Brilliant! Retro assisting Fulmer emphatically just like that. Potentially saving grace there. 3-1.
from bottom of the group to the top. CSK in Moscow and Real Madrid could still prevent Plzen from going top. CSK in Moscow with the momentum on their side as they scored more goals in the second group, their second group game compared to Real Madrid. Moscow blue, Madrid in orange. And Storm takes the first goal. First blood to Moscow. Defensive work there from Retro there. Keeping it in the opposition's area. Retro almost managed to get the goal there. Retro with the shot there, couldn't quite get it on target. Guys, quit messing around. Nice little nudge there. Retro almost got a 2 0 there, but not to be. Minute and a half to go, still 1 0 to Moscow. This will put them top of the group unless Madrid come up with something. Uh, high paced deflection there. Armstrong with the shot, not to be. Great save there from Foma. 
on Buzz's shot. Thirty seconds left. Demolition on Buzz. Great defensive work there from Retro. And Madrid's campaign is in trouble. Last group of the day. Young boys in Manchester United. Followed by Valencia and Juventus. And right out of the gates, Manchester United won no up. Swabby couldn't do anything to get it out. And surely not, are you kidding me? That's... That's two nil to Manchester United now. Great shot there from Retro. Their last games, the young boys annihilated Valencia 6-2. Juventus beating Manchester United 2-1. Valencia yet to get off the mark. Could that change against Juventus today? The way to look at it, momentum will be on Juventus' side. Valencia yet to get off the mark in this campaign. One for me, y'all. One for Gretro! There we go! Cool as a cucumber! First touch there. Are United gonna get three? No, they are not. Boomer there with the clearance. Great 
great clearance there from Boomer. On to Foma. Into the midfield now. Two minutes left. Whoa! That's one for the highlight reel. Double demolition. One on Jester. One on Shepard. Not enough. Chipper gets the hat trick. Roma with the shot. And Swabby assisted by Retro. Fantastic work there. Retro tried to get it in for the equaliser. Still in the danger area. What a save from Chipper. Oh, Retro tried to get it there, wasn't to be. There's 15 seconds left. The young boys could still salvage this. They could still take it to overtime. Not to be. And Manchester United. A valiant effort there from the young boys. If it's any consolation, they keep top of the group. And they will stay top. They will stay top for the rest of the day. Now, unless Juventus give Valencia an absolute hammering, it will be the young boys that will stay top of the group. Well played there from Sabretooth. Sabretooth there with the shot there. Retro tried as well. And Tex puts Juventus ahead. Juventus need to win by six. No, they need to win by seven to have any chance of topping the group. 
It's not out of the realm of possibility. You never know what's going to happen. That's 2-0 already. Five to go before they top the group. Could still happen, you never know. And that's three. Come, surely four. It is four. Juventus are determined! Juventus are determined to top the group! And they could still do so! Business just picked up here. The goal is wide open and Khan makes it six. This is beggar's belief. They only need one more and they'll confirm their spot on the top of the group. The only thing they'll have left to do now is maintain a clean sheet and right now they have done just that. Khan almost made it seven there. He almost got himself a hat trick I believe. Not if Retro has anything to do with it! Juventus could still top the group on goal difference. There's still time. Commentator's curse strikes again on the other hand. Regarding the clean sheet. Way too much power.
Retro clears it away. Demolition there, Jester with the shot. Retro demolishing Tex. Just when we thought it looked likely that Madrid would top the group, Valencia's goal has prevented them from doing so. That is how the groups look as it stands at the end of match day three. The only teams still unbeaten are Shakhtar Donetsk, Lokomotiv Moscow, and that's it. Paris Saint-Germain, Schalke, Valencia, all yet to get a win. So far, the second half of the group stage is going to be crucial for these guys. How will they fare? Tune in, tune in very soon to find out. But in the meantime, hope you enjoyed what you saw. If you did, as always, hit the thumbs up. And if you want to be baptized into following this channel, hit the subscribe button down at the bottom. Click the bell to join the latter day scenes notification squad so you don't miss anything I do on this channel. Everything wrong with the apprentice on the left, on the right, Rocket League season five. Walking Dead reactions tomorrow. Until then, enjoy the rest of your day. Peace out. Stay faithful as always.